Hey there people, I'm a friendly neighborhood Let's Players, but I want to welcome you back to Paradigm. It's been a long time since we've been here because uh, sometimes real life just gets in the way, you know. But now that we're here, we can go and meet with the baller, the not the drug dealer guy. Nights, 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 nights. Meanwhile at customer service. Beautiful hair. Sir? No, ma'am. Sir. Ma'am. I've been waiting here all day. Can you please see to us? It doesn't seem like you're doing anything. Hang on, I'm doing really secretary stuff. Ting, ting. Psh. MS Payne, huh? Secretary <sighs> night is the best. All right, done. What do you need? I have a complaint. Complaints? Oh, wonderful. It's what I live for. Our so son. Anybody should be living. The prodigy child that we bought on the 22nd of January 2016 is faulty. What do you mean, faulty? They aren't budget, no-name electronics that break, crushing your children's hopes and dreams on Christmas morning. They'll say, why doesn't Santa love us, Mummy? Why did he give us broken presents? I think he has issues. He bought the official one, but no, you wanted to save a few bucks. He is faulty. All right, calm down, miss. What seems to be the problem? He... He... To the be he the problem. to become an artist. Jesus Christ, Mom. I'm not an artist. I'm a two-dimensional... Oh, God, uh, he's tearing our family apart. What's the retro all stuff? All right, all right. We've seen this before. Can you please sign these papers? And if you don't mind, little Johnny, stand on that little circle thing over there. Hey, man. I don't conform to your ideals. Go slay some dragons, you inconsiderate pig. What if I told you that over there, on the circle there, is a gluten-free mocha papito latte? Really? Not bad. Ah! I guess. I'm so sorry, miss. This has been a fault with the oldest line of prodigy children. Again, I apologize. Just sign the waiver here and we'll get you the replacement. What's wrong about being an artist? I don't see anything wrong about being an artist. I mean, people doing Let's Play videos, that's a kind of an art. Video games are an art. I mean, just look at all this art that we're seeing right here. And that's uh, what that kid was wanting to do. Being a pixel shaman. Making pixel art. Nothing wrong with that. Some pixel art actually is extremely well done and good looking. Must be some sort of a gaming chair. It looks like I it because there's by a... the sweat, stains, food crumbs, uh -huh. and the name so done, Super Elite Master Ultimate Performance Chair. Speaking of chairs, I need to get myself a new chair. That's a very interesting looking painting. Looks like it's been done by an Andy Warhol clone. Yeah. A literal clone, that is. But Shinsuke didn't really have much when it came to culture, so they just cloned celebrities to can't direct it. Well, that's a one of way of taking business out of new uh, talent. Just take the old talent, clone it. Yeah, that's what the world needs. Clones. Sometimes I contemplate life when looking out the windows. Many people and do. I that. realize it sucks. <laughs> I think about dragons and wizards. That too. Yeah, then people start to think about that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Like most things in Crush, it is out of order. Of course. And like most things in Crush, it is probably extremely dangerous. Well, of course. It stays out of order. Uh -huh. It's a lot of stuff to look at here. But then again, it's an adventure game. Is this space dust? Could be. Oh, it's just piles and piles of little papers with dead jokes on them. One says, I am a dad. I am responsible for my children and being witty. This is too much stress and responsibility for me to handle. I'm not sure whoever wrote these understands how jokes work. Yeah, those are not jokes. Those are just uh, statements. Okay, what's the story here? I've seen my fair share of genetically enhanced talking octopodes, but one that is an apathetic retail cashier? It is truly an honor to experience this. Are you sure it would be an honor? Big TV and a small TV. I'm not entirely sure what the point of the smaller one is. Yeah, that's what I was I thinking. to make the large one look even bigger. 
Probably. Kind of like when you shave the hedges. Mm hmm Yeah, yeah. Hey, look, it's a Mega Bro Avoid the Reality System. Never has escapism been so satisfying. <laughs> Avoid reality system. Um, that's, uh, that's a good way of uh, speaking about consoles and everything. It looks like it's uh, busted on one side and covered in sticky soda pop. So it's been in good use. That's what, it's, what he's trying to say. That it's been in extremely good use. Poop Sonic X2. I've heard about this model. It's huge. The downside is that it emits radiation causing infertility. Also, now that I notice that there is a Mario pipe here, a war pipe. Hey, a war pipe. I've always wondered what it's like inside. <laughs> Woohoo! Oh, Jesus. I don't want to know anymore. Well, it was very trippy until we heard Mario. Woohoo! Sometimes I pretend I'm a predator and hide behind ferns, hunting the elusive self respect. Ha! Ha ha! 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 Ha ha! Heh. Something about this is wrong, but uh, I don't think a social movement exists for this yet. Well, at least the uh, grandpa is on roller skates and a. Uh... Crutch? How does that work? I mean, that's even more dangerous when you think about it. Oh, well, let's talk to him. Hello, drug silly man. Hello. Insert name here. Refer Paradigm. Refer their name if you can. It allows you to connect on a more friendly personal level. What? Oh, I'm just trying out some techniques I read in an audiobook. Ah. You kind of, kind of take it very literally there. You're just supposed to say the person's name, if you know it. And you should know that this is paradigm. Weird world, weird people. And also, the voice actor for the drug dealer sounds very familiar. I should look it up. Can I buy some space dust now? I think I've gone through enough. Uh -huh. Well, if you have a thousand cruise marks, I can give you the token for the vending machine over there. Oh my word. I don't have the cash for that. Also, token? Super fun, cool, drug enthusiast drug tokens. The official currency for the vending machine. No space dust for you. But tough biddies. So he doesn't really sell drugs. He just sells tokens for the machine where you can get the drugs from. I don't see anything illegal about this at all. It's a very legitimate business. It's a vending machine after all. I'm sure we can come to an understanding. Yeah, don't wink what again, ever. What does that wink mean? I don't know. I saw it in a movie once. Thought it might work. Nope. Well, you weren't very convincing with the wink. You're also supposed to give a smile and maybe a little nudge nudge. You just go, I think we can get, I can, I think we can sort out a deal here. Usually those don't work, anyway. Is there uh, anything else I can do? I can bake a mean cupcake that will blow your mind. Sounds good All to me. Right. No one ever buys from me anyway, so I'll play you for it. Yes? If you can beat my game's high score, I'll give you a super fun, cool drug enthusiast drug token. Okay. Now, what game is that? Prepare your body. It's the most brutal, unforgiving game ever developed. Pac-Man. An underground classic sought by collectors everywhere. Space Invaders. Behold! Boosting damn. thugs. It's not working. Hold on. God damn piece of shit ruining my finely crafted atmosphere. I'm never buying floor stock again. Activate cartridge blow. Don't blow in it. That actually is the, is the most... Uh, no, that uh, definitely says my thing. It says, Psh! which is a sound effect for water. That's my thing. Psh! What is it about? It's from leaderboard. Right, Commodore's 
grab that controller over there. All right. Uh, that's what I needed this controller for. I've, I'm sure this is a faulty one. And we can change. So the big TV is just for show. It doesn't work. And that is the functional TV. Got it. That's what it's for. All right. Oh, dude, gross. This controller is all sticky and only leads to one side. I hate it. This? That's yeah. what she said. <laughs> no, it's she. Isn't said. it she said? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and my online comedian degree is a scam. It is. Who thought you could get full-fledged degrees in three days and only at the price of full control of my life insurance? I Bargain. think you. Yeah, Next I think you got scammed. Scene field masterclass. Anyway, you're stuck with the guest controller. Deal with it. Oh man, I can't deal with this. I'll need another controller. And sunglasses if you're gonna go with the deal with it. Man, guess only controllers are such bullshit. Hey, drug dealer. There's your self-respect on the roof. What? Let's play this thing. Yeah. Let's do this. Um, Alright, let's do this. I can only imagine what kind of a game there. <laughs> Well, it's a good start. Is this a Streets of Rage? Press anything to start. I can either be Natasha or Dude. Girl, those are super cute boots. Dude, nice shirt, is it new? At least they're nice. Yeah, boy! Time to bust some dog heads and get positive reinforcement. Before they know it, they'll have a mortgage and a be loveless, whatever relationship. Welcome to boosting thugs. Thanks, man. Press the letter Z to jump. Okay. Yes. Press the letter X to punch. Dope. These don't help you at all in this game, although it will keep you car your cardio up. And thanks! Your mission is to boost stock sales esteem with compliments and make them reevaluate the goal practice on the sandwich over there. Man, the text goes by fast. Uh, yo, sandwich dude, looking delicious. Is that salami? I'm impressed. You would be at least 20, per 20 bucks at the local deli. Good job, man. Lettuce, so nutritious. Good job! Lettuce! Let us try, let us. Yo, sandwich is looking delicious, that salami I am impressed. You would be at least 20 bucks at the local deli, good job, man. Cheers, daughter. Yay! I'm a sign! Derp. Oh, snap! Terrible surprise. Uh-huh. And also saw a kitty cat there. In the background. So, X and B are totally useless in this game, huh? Give me all your mana, I'll prepare to die. Tubule! Stand designer, I bet uh, your staff has plus 10 to be a cool guy. Nice one. Hmm. I will take that uh, plus 10. Cool guy. Because that should work. It also has 10, plus 10 to keep me all your mana or I kill you. <laughs> Whoa, is that magic? You could probably have your own TV show or something and at least cosplay at a con. You're... Thanks, bro. I think I will reevaluate this whole street thug career thing. Yes! You do that. Thug boosted! And also, there's Club Rat over there. Dank pipes. Can I boost uh, the uh, picture on the wall? The cone! We already took care of the cone. Hey kid, wanna hail some Satan? Will it boost his self-esteem? Yeah, I guess it would. I never thought of it that way. Oh yes, let's do it! Hail Satan! Wow! Hot dog machine! Wow! 
Surprise, you dweeb. Give me all your lo-fi recording. Uh, oh, sorry. Hey, Peter. Hey, yeah, it's Bjorn. Kind of looks like, uh... Badass music. But, uh... Kind of looks like, um... What's his name? He's from, uh... From comic... Lobo! From DC Comics. Yeah, Lobo. The, uh... The headhunter on a space motorcycle. Really brutal dude. Who can't die. There is a comic book called The Mask vs. Lobo, where they, each other, they just try to kill each other in so many ways. Very brutal, very gruesome, but also a very fun comic book. X-rated, or R-rated at least, because of the uh, blood, a lot of blood and stuff. Sweet guitar, lightning dude thing, nice makeup. I think I will go with the guitar, because that is a sweet, sweet V guitar. Sweet guitar dude, I bet you could start up one man black metal band and have a small but loyal following. That's why I'm doing street crime in the first place, and at least in one form of grim brutality. Nice makeup, you could probably make a solid career out of that. Well, I, I never considered that, it's always been my dream, but I didn't think it was a viable career option. Well then, thanks dude, we're back to the of hell to get my makeup supplies. Yeah, makeup. Peace. Rock on! Both ways. <laughs> whoa, whoa. I'm a street shark? Badass! Yes! Continue game. Input password using ZX or press B to... Oh, yes. I boosted the hell out of those thugs. So did I win? Yeah, you did pretty well. Only 34,123 levels to go. What? Really? I don't have time for this. I have actual stuff to do. I don't believe you. Uh, true. Still, mm. still, yep. no space dust. I'm Elfies. Best. I think I can help you be boosting thugs. Huh? Do tell. Space yeah. Legends trucker. say that there is a mythical code to beat any Mega Bro game. Like a Konami code? For yeah. legal reasons, no. Well, okay. how can I get it? It's said to be lost to time and space. Forever. Yeah, sick. That's great help. Let mm -hmm. me finish, Jesus. There are whisperings that it can be found lost in electromagnetic waves. Thanks, I think. In the radio, somehow. Radio waves. Hmm. Uh, can I have a better hint? That's all I can say. Okay. Yes, but can I have a slightly superior hint? Hey man, I'm trying to help you out as much as I can. Can I ask you about super crack? Hint? No. Wow, we. Thank you. I'll go solve it. Why are you helping me get free space dust? I just really hate the drug dealer, to be honest. Understandable. Because you're in a, just a tank and working as a vending machine. Okay, so next time we are going to go out there to find this mystical super code to defeating boosting thugs. Okay. So hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully you like this new layout that I have. And I hope you all have a good evening, good afternoon, and a good morning, and I will see you all next time. <sighs> My outros are just getting weirder and weirder. Take care, people. Bye.